Hey everyone, how's everybody doing? Happy Wednesday to all. Um, I got uh, a couple knives that came in. I just got back from the doctor's office from this morning. I had a visit. I had some things I had to get done. Um, but um, yeah, so I just got back from the doctor's office, pulled down the driveway, looked in my mailbox, and I got a couple of knives that I've been waiting for. And the one that's in front of you now is the CJRB Feldspar in Jade uh, Scales. I got went with the three and a half inch. I was tossed up. Um, ah, it's a shame I was pestering a JB from Big Red EDC. And I kept on blowing his phone up, ask, you know, asking him, what should I do? I'm ordering this knife. What should I get? The three and a half inch or the three inch? And, uh, you know, he basically told me they're both, you know, they're both pretty darn good. You know what I mean? You, you'll be happy whatever you whatever you choose. And sure enough, that, that's the case. I mean, whether it be the three and a half or the three. Although, I can tell you this much right now. Guys, I am not blowing smoke. I am so happy I went with the three and a half inch. I think the three inch would have been just a little bit too small. Because this three and a half inch is just a perfect, perfect size. I mean, it is a perfect size um, for me, for me. Now, I did blow a little compressed air in it uh, when I got this. Um, and I just put a drip of KPL on it because it was already running real nice. And... Um, it's it's just a super i don't have to tell you guys anything about these cjrb knives i mean basic i'm not sounding like a broken record but i mean if you get one you you've gotten them all because the feeling of them the action is all the same just about the action is just the same if you get this knife through the mail you know right now before you even open or close it what the action is going to be like you know the action is going to be dynamite it's running all bearings. I mean, they make a quality. I mean, what are you going? What are you going to open up the knife and, and and be disappointed? No, they just make a great, great budget knife, man. Um, you know what I mean? If you're looking for action and that's your thing, these these knives. I mean, this knife was 30, 35, the three and a half inch one, and I mean. Like I said, guys, I'm not going to dwell on it. You just know what it is. I mean, it's a pretty knife. I mean, you're getting a lot. D2 blade. I mean, you're getting a lot, a lot of knife. A lot of cutlery nowadays for this uh, $35 mark. Between $30 and $50. I mean, if you got a $50 bill in your pocket, I mean, guys, <laughs> you could get a great piece of cutlery right now if you got a hole to burn for $50, bucks, man. <laughs> I mean, you, there's so many just great knives out there in that $50, 30 to $50 mark. I mean, come on. I mean, I'm telling you, they're just, they're battling. They just want your business, man. They just keep upping it and upping it. You know, look at this, $35. You're getting D2, Jade Scales, Contoured. I mean, let's talk about this. I mean, they're Contoured Scales. Look, nice stone washing on that blade. Look at that blade. You know, how? what more can you want for 35 bucks? Look at that decorative pivot on it. Look at that nice brass decorative pivot. You know, you got that liner inset there. It's easy to manipulate with your finger there. Really easy to get in there. And I mean, opening and closing. Look at this. You just can't understand. I am not even... Well, I, I'm not even pushing it down a lot, like barely, like, watch. Barely, barely touching it. And it just sucks right back into them liners. You got the centering that is dead down the pike. I mean, great centering. Um, it's just a great knife. I mean, you know what they are. We're not going to go on too much about that. But anyway, I got another knife in. And, uh. You know what? I'll show you this real fast and I'll do the video later. This is just a sneak peek. I got another uh, Solid in Germany uh, 
This is called the um, the three rivet knife. Um, this is the Otter Messer three rivet knife. Now, this knife is coming in at fifty dollars. When I tell you there's not one single gap in the back spring, look at this. Look at the fit and finish. Look at this wood. Look at this. Fifty dollars, guys. Fifty dollars. These guys are. I'm, I've tried telling you guys they know how to do a knife. These German guys, man, Solid in Germany. If you're getting a knife from Solid in Germany, look at this. Hold on. There you go. Solid in Germany. That's what you want to see right there. See it? Otter. See the little otter on the uh, the blade? But now what I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to force the patina. I have to force the patina on this one. I think it's going to look great. And later on today after I get done this video, I'm going to go down. I'm going to force the patina. And I'll show you what she looks like after that. This is a great, great knife, guys, for 50 bucks. What a heck of a piece of cutlery this is. Um, I'll show you guys later. Um, but there you go. Um, that's the two pieces that I got in uh, today. And uh, I'm going to relax for a minute. Because I've been running around. So uh, I'm going to just, I wanted to shoot this video real fast just to show you guys what I got. And, uh. I'll show you guys, uh, I'll do another video later about what the, when I do the patina on that. So, uh, yeah, guys, stick with me. Let me know what's going on. I'd appreciate a comment. Be careful out there. It's a warm one here in South Jersey. Really, really warm. Um, I just appreciate the comments, man. Let me know what you think about this three and a half inch feldspar. Great, great knife. Great, great knife. And I'll tell you, I'll tell you the truth, man. You will be happy if you go with the three and a half. I'm telling you, for the most part, you are going to be dissatisfied with the three inch knife. It's just going to feel a little small. I'm telling you, it's going to just feel a little small, like where that pinky just kind of hangs off the end. One of them deals. All right, guys, let me know what you think, please. Uh, this is Pete over here and um, stick with me. Drop me many, many comments. Because I love reading them. And, uh, yeah. Let's just do it. Yeah. Alright, guys. Listen. Take care. Be safe out there. Alright. Take care.